Hello everyone, this is Team Gadmode and we are here with the in-depth review of the Honor 8. Honor 8 is a flagship smartphone that's made by Honor, a sub-brand under the Huawei group as a part of the Huawei Honor series. So basically this is a Chinese phone with a good build quality. One of the highlights of the phone is the Honor's custom fork of Android Marshmallow called Emotion UI or EMUI 4.1. So this is a single layered interface with its own icon, settings app and notification shade. The layout of the notifications can always be changed, which is a pretty cool feature. Honor has changed its design completely and this new phone looks slim and striking. On the right, we have the volume rocker and the power button well stacked along the edges. And on the top, we have these antenna bands that run across both the sides. The left side houses a dual SIM slot with an air blast on the top. The front cam is an 8 megapixel shooter and on the bottom, we have the speakers, a USB-C type charging port and the 3.5mm jack. The back has a fingerprint sensor with dual cam and LED flash. The dual camera setup consists of individual 12 megapixel color and monochrome sensors which is a great offering with this price tag. Coming to the back, this is entirely made up of glass and this does attract a lot of fingerprints. But this can be resolved with a simple swipe by a small piece of cloth. The fingerprint reader on the back of the Honor 8 is quite good. It's fast and at the same time accurate too. So this adds up to the security features of this phone. Every phone has its own set of extra features and in the case of Honor 8, it's these shortcuts that you have on the lock screen. For instance, this torch icon activates a flashlight, which might be very useful when you are out in the dark. And next comes the camera icon that activates the camera app directly from the lock screen. Second in the row is the calculator whose practical use at this place is very much justified provided you do a lot of calculations but are lazy enough to unlock the screen. Next, let's go to the settings where the fingerprint management option gives us a lot of choices as to how to make use of the fingerprint sensor in different ways. This can also be considered as one of the additional features. The set of features that make this phone a smartphone is the smart assistance. The smart assistance menu in the settings is where you are going to find the bulk of the awesome EMUI features. For instance, you have here the feature to switch to mini screen which is very much helpful when you are unable to hold the device with one hand. And then there is the keyboard shift feature that allows you to shift the keyboard to the choice of your side. Then comes the other set of options that allow you to use this phone to its pure opulence and out of these features is the most distinctive one, the knuckle sense. It is a carryover feature from Huawei's P8, Mate 8 and the P9 that lets you launch the apps and perform actions with gestures made with your knuckle. You can capture a screenshot by double tapping the screen with one knuckle or record a video by tapping the screen twice with two knuckles. So let's have a practical look at this feature. The rear cam is comprised of a two 12 megapixel cameras which is capable of many cool tricks because the Honor 8 can combine sensor data from its twin snappers to improve the overall picture quality. Out of these two cameras, one camera has a traditional RGB sensor which captures color data while the second one, a monochrome sensor, measures the brightness. The Honor 8 software combines the two streams into one single image, a feature Huawei said gives the Honor 8 and the P9 a diagrammatic leg up in the low light environments. The in-depth review of the camera and the different modes of photography that are available on this phone will be covered up in our next video that will be specifically for the camera review of this phone. With that being said, this was the in-depth review of the Honor 8.
and thank you everyone for watching please subscribe to our channel share our video and like our video and stay tuned to our channel for much more interesting videos